Hello, it's Wednesday, October 28th. I'm Keenan Smith with your headlines. We're following a train derailment that happened this morning along I-94 in Dearborn. A rail car jumped the tracks and ended up hanging over an overpass. It caused lane closures on eastbound I-94 exit to uh, Michigan Avenue in Wyoming. CSX crews are working to fix the damaged bridge. Stay with 7 Action News and WXYZ.com for the latest developments. And with just six days before the election, a judge has struck down Michigan's open carry ban at the polls. The judge calling the move unlawful. The measure would have banned guns within 100 feet of a polling location on Election Day. Michigan Secretary of State and Michigan Attorney General Dana Nessel say they do plan to appeal the motion before Election Day. And Vice President Mike Pence will be back in Michigan tonight for a rally in Flint. Pence will speak at Bishop International Airport at 7 p.m. Supporters will be allowed to attend on a first come first served basis and tomorrow Dr. Jill Biden will be in Michigan to campaign for her husband Democratic nominee Joe Biden. She has stops planned in Lansing and Westland and then on Saturday Joe Biden will hold a rally here in the Great Lakes state. We'll let you know where that rally will take place as soon as details are released. Sun's back out today, a high of 53 degrees. It's going to be the nicer uh, after one of the nicer afternoons that we get through the rest of the week because the below average temperatures trend continues. Back to the 40s tomorrow with more clouds and a 30% chance of showers through the afternoon. Decreasing clouds Friday, but a high of only 46. It'll be sunny for Halloween Saturday, high of 51. So we'll be in the 40s for trick or treaters Saturday evening. Clocks go back one hour Sunday. We have a chance of showers Sunday morning.